in here. Hey everyone, Tim here from QBKing77.com here to do a video doing a full review of the upcoming Gmail 4.2 application. Um, this will be a, an update coming in the future. You can install it if you are rooted, so you do need to make sure your device is rooted. Uh, the initial process would be to install uh, Titanium Backup or ROM Toolbox on your device. You can get it from the Play Store, so Titanium Backup or ROM Toolbox. Once you have those installed, go ahead and uninstall the current Gmail application on your device. So go ahead and use either, I use Titanium Backup myself, I just went ahead and uninstalled G the old Gmail application and once you have uninstalled it, you can actually reboot your phone and once you reboot you can uh, now manually install the new Gmail application. It's an APK file, just install it like any other third party application, just download it, put it on your phone use a file explorer or you can just download it from your phone. Um, I will link to the Gmail application in the description where you can get the download exclusively from Android Police. So big shout out to my good friends over at Android Police for putting this APK out for us. All right, so let's go ahead and go over some of the new features. I've installed it myself, been using it for a little while now. Right away, I wanna go over some of the major things. Uh, first of all, it does now have pinch to zoom. So you will see when you open up uh, emails now, it might show a little bit smaller. The reason being because you can now pinch in and zoom in, which is great. Obviously, so many people have been waiting for this update to occur, and now, now you can actually pinch to zoom in on these new on these emails. Unfortunately, it does not text wrap. So you'll see when I'm looking at this uh, YouTube email, it's not text wrapping for me, which isn't too big of a deal, I guess, um, as I'm, I'm not used to being able to pinch zoom anyways. Uh, otherwise, though, also another new update is it has um, some swiping actions that you can use. So let's go ahead and check those out. First of all, you can go ahead and press Menu and go into Settings. And under Settings, go to General Settings, and you will see Swiping Conversation List. You can have it have no effect, Archive or Deletes, or Always Deletes. You can have either of those options. Now, uh, what that means is you can find an, app, uh, an email. Let's say I have an email I want to, I have it set for Delete. So let's say I find an email I want to delete or I can delete, I can just delete an email right here, swipe it away, it gets deleted, I can undo it right there if I would like to as well. Or you can have it archive the file, uh, that's just another nice new feature, again you can swipe it away, delete it, you can undo it if you want it back, you can go either way with the swiping of your emails. Otherwise though, it has a new attachment system where uh, with the attachments around the bottom, you'll see I have a message right here. Uh, and the attachments are now below as opposed to above. I attached a couple image files. If you go ahead and go to the image, uh, you'll see it just opens up this thumbnail. I'm not exactly sure why. You can press and hold on it, and it doesn't do anything. But now you can press Menu and hit Save, Save All, Share, Share All, so you can uh, manage all the attachments at once or just save this one particular uh, attachment. So those are, that's another nice new feature of the Gmail application. That's really about it though, that's all I wanted to show everyone. I mean, those are all the main features, uh, some of the best ones being pinched to zoom. Along with that swipe feature, that's pretty neat. If you just get a, an email you don't even wanna read, you just can delete it or archive it right away. So uh, those are some just of the, some of the new, uh, nice, neat new features of the Gmail 4.2 application. You can install it for yourself if you're rooted. Let me know what you think of it. Be sure to leave a comment. Be sure to subscribe as well. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Google+. All links will be in the description of the video below. As always, thanks for watching. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up.